Look closely and you'll see thieves able to open locked car doors. It's like they have their own key. It's happened all across America. NBC5 has learned of a new way thieves are breaking into your cars. And here in Canada. One guy has something in his hand and bingo, it opens. But even police don't know what device thieves are using to get in. We've arrested a lot of people over the years um, in the act of stealing cars and we've never come across one. Is it getting easier? Um, for some it is because they've got the technology to, to do it. Marketplace tracked down one example of that technology in Los Angeles. So how much did this one cost you? This is about $30. Security researcher Sammy Kamkar says all cars could be susceptible to electronic theft. His device works by blocking the signal your fob sends to your car and recording it. So now that signal is programmed in here, I can disable this. And when I want, I can go up to the car and I can unlock it. And then, <gasps> just using this. But GM says they're on it. They're the first of the big three automakers to work with hackers to fix security flaws. How worried should car owners be about the threat of cyber attacks? Car owners should know that their vehicles are safe. They should also know that the industry is coming together to address this challenge. Meantime, if you're worried about this new breed of car thief, try this old school tip. Lock your car without using your electronic fob. Charles Agro, CBC News, Toronto. The full marketplace investigation airs tonight on CBC television.